awake. Still in this house? Why am I still stuck? Why can't I leave? I need to find a way out. I've been here before though. These doors open and there's nothing there. John, please. Oh, this is Mike Peterson from Sales Alpha. Uh, he was expecting my call. We actually had an appointment for around uh, 245. I know I'm a couple minutes late. Huh. Do you know when he's gonna be back in the office today? Uh, a CRM. Yeah. Yeah, he talked to me. He, he knows me and everything. I actually came in and did a presentation. Yeah, uh, no, it's it's Mike, Mike Peterson. Yeah. 540-333. One three three four. Just tell him to give me a call when when he's. When, thanks so much. Okay, bye bye. Okay. Well, I can leave my name and number again. I called him two different times. Spoke to him once. He told me to follow up. Well, is there any way that you could just write a note, put it on his desk, if you don't mind? Because he was definitely expecting my call. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Why? You know what? Why don't you make a U-turn? That makes sense, right? Thanks. I'm always willing to have another conversation. Come in, you know, show you the new features that I'm sure we're releasing on a daily basis. Okay. Right. Well, you have a good rest of your day too, man. Okay. Right. Thanks. Bye. You're available now. Great. Um, I'm on 12th, so I think it's about 10 minutes. Is that good? Great. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thanks so much. I'll see you soon. Yep, Paul, sounds good. Uh, yeah, we'll work out the logistics at some point early next week. Uh, we'll figure the whole thing out, yeah. Yep. Yep, uh, maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. Yep, sounds good. Yeah, just, uh, you know, let Linda know. You know, I said hey and the kids. Yep, I'll do the same. All right. All right, buddy. All right, talk to you next week. Bye-bye. Mike, hey, Jeremy, how you doing, bud? Great, thanks for having me back. It's good to see you. God, this is really exciting. I think we've gotten through all the due diligence and we're ready to sign, right? Uh, you know, our company was really impressed with your proposal. Uh, we like you, uh, but you know, we brought you in because you were in the area. You know, we wanted to tell you in person. Uh, unfortunately, you know, it's just not cost effective for us. Well, you got to remember that we can we can address those things. That's not a, you just tell us what you sort of want that end number to be, and we can get there. I'm, I'm confident. No, I'm sorry, Mike. It's just it's just not going to work. Is there possibly anything else that we can do to sort of open this back up? Uh, you know, from a logistical perspective, you know, we have these upstream, these downstream dependencies, and it's really you know, a matter of molding those two together. Really getting a good picture of both, and the cost really is the, the, the issue. You know, as we look at, you know, some of the semantics from... You know, Don't do this to me. I can't have you do this. I needed this. Still stuck. Mike, do you understand? Mike. Um, yeah, I, I appreciate your time, Jeremy. I, I really do. Yeah, and man. Yeah. You know, we'll try to, pleasure. we'll try to keep in Always touch. Always good to see you, buddy. Scott. Thank you. Yeah, I'll let you know if anything comes up. Yeah, definitely. Appreciate it. Thanks, change. Have a good. Uh, yep. Good rest of you. All right. Yeah. You too. Watch out, bro. Why? Why did
did you do that? Why do I get so mad? I can't be here anymore. This. this isn't me. Can I get another, please? I've been here before, though. However, it's been five fucking years. typical or just a random bad day starts with a rough day in the office asshole bumping into you in the street ending it with a couple of drinks just another day right for me it wasn't still in this house that I can't escape. I'm fucking trapped. Do you know how to leave? I'm at the door. For you, this is just another day. For me, this is what it's like to be unstable.